welcome to my channel. My name is Carla Frankie and today I have a organize your filing cabinet and declutter all that paper that you have in there. So I'm just showing you guys the before shot. It's somewhat organized but not really because it's not categorized or anything. But I'm just showing you all the top drawer right now and then the bottom drawer is just a bunch of papers, envelopes, and just random stuff that probably doesn't even belong in here. But I'm just gonna bring y'all through the process and show you guys how much I actually get rid of that is not being used or is useful in any way. So I hope you guys enjoy. If you do like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I would hugely appreciate it. As you see right now, I have gotten rid of all these papers and folders and filing and then the pile on the right is just trash, like it's trash, I don't need it. And like I said, this white one right here, that is all being shredded. Stuff that doesn't have use for it right now, so we're just gonna get rid of it, declutter, and get rid of it. So I am super happy about getting rid of all of it. Okay, so I have gone through even more papers, more of the filing cabinet, more filing folders, more just folders in general, and more trash as well that I have gone through to go through this filing cabinet. All that paper was trash that was in there. So that's pretty awesome to finally get through it all and throw it away and get rid of clutter pretty much. The white stack of paper is being shredded. And here are Jake and Braden's little projects that they did for the last two to three years. So I just need to go through it and compile it just a little better. And all the mess that comes with organizing. I know like you have to take pretty much everything out and it's kind of messy before you have to put everything back in. There it was all cleaned out, thankfully. Um, like I said, everything takes time, so just take your time with this process, and it may take a couple of days, but that's okay. And here's our, this is my high school picture, and then I'm going to show you Josh's. Hopefully he doesn't mind. Um, but yeah, this is when we were young, and quite some time ago. Alright guys, so I decided to do Jake and Brayden's old ones. I just made them a little bit more organized and put the rubber bands, which I think will help. And then, so down here, so much more organized as you can tell. I know what I have. And then I just have like envelopes right here, some pictures, oh here, here's the envelopes. Sorry. Here's the envelopes for like packaging and whatnot. And then I put some pictures like in a uh, little clear form. And then I just put the like owner's manuals for the new toys that we have and just put them in here all together. It's an old calendar. And then our mortgage company stuff. And then my school nurse little banners that I kept. I put them all like neatly. So that's how much room I have. All right guys, so here is the finished product. It took me a long time to finally get this organized. I kind of have it by color coded just to keep it nicer because I had it all scattered as you saw. I have the bills in the front that we use very often. And then we have like the boy stuff, Brayden Medical, and then Jake School. And then here is his like first, and then Kinder. It took me some time, a lot of going back and forth, if I should put like all the pictures together, all the report cards together like in one file, or if I should just keep one per year. So one file per year. And I went with keeping one file per year. So for Kinder, or here's what I decided to do right here. So I did pictures first, report card, awards, and then crafts. So that's exactly what I did for 
his kinder. I have all the pictures. And then I have his report card. So if I need to go back to whatever grade it is, I have it all together. And then I have his little awards that he got. And then all of his crafts that he has right here um, for the year. So everything's all in one. All in one. So, and I think that'll make it easy. And then just got my husband's stuff over here. And then my stuff over here. Um, work, school. Um, random stuff like cards I put, TRICARE rentals, since we have to rent because of military. All right guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and got some inspiration for your filing cabinet in your office or just inspiration in any way to organize and declutter. This really helped me to get rid of papers that I didn't really need, so it really was helpful. If you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel. I would greatly appreciate it so much, and I hope you guys have a great day. I will see you in the next video. Bye!